Hello and welcome to the video. Today we will be trying to install macOS El Capitan and upgrade it from macOS Leopard, which is what it's running right now, 10.5.8. So first I'm going to try and upload, upgrade it to Snow Leopard, which is what which is the minimum minimum operating system that you can upgrade to El Capitan El Capitan as well uh, directly. But if that doesn't work, I've got macOS Lion that I can put on in between, and hopefully that will work definitely. So it's just yeah, plug in here. I've already flashed at macOS Leopard, like a slow leopard onto it. It is still macOS 10. It is 2.4 gigahertz Corti Duo, top of the range one from 2007. It's got a 1.8 gigabyte SSD in it. Yeah, install. Password. And now let's start the time lapse. Okay, so I installed Snow Leopard. Let's press continue. I'm going to install the updates because I want to make sure it's. And the the time lapse didn't work. So I'm going to try and fix that now. Okay, so this is Snow Leopard. It's essentially the same as uh, Leopard, but it's got the app store. And it's a lot less buggy. 10.6.8, Diego, it's all the same. Let's do Lion. Okay, let's just skip line. Let's just let's see whether El Capitan works. Let's go into There you go. It's still macOS 10 El Capitan. Agree, agree, install. There you go. Now let's put this in the time lapse. Bye. <laughs> Okay, so I installed oh, El Capitan, it seemed to work fine. I can't believe you can just upgrade straight from straight from a Snow Leopard up to El Capitan. There you go, from how it was. And uh, mostly. Mostly the good way. In the minimum version, all the way up to the maximum version in a day. No faff and about, it's just pretty. Yep. 24 gigahertz, 40 duo, 4 gig of RAM, ATR radio on HD, whatever you want. But, it seems to be working fine. Well, I think that's the end of this video. Bye.